Back in 1995, Ferrari had a problem. How could they follow the extreme and extremely wonderful F40? The answer was this, the F50. A road-going Ferrari with the V12 engine from a Formula One car bolted in the back. Except, as it turned out, it didn't feel bolted in the back. It felt bolted to your back. As a result, the abiding memory for anyone who drove an F50 wasn't the ferocious acceleration or the 200 mile an hour top speed. It was the sense that you'd had a furiously spinning washing machine full of bricks hammering directly into your most sensitive pain receptors. Add in the fact that it liked to bite back in the corners, and what you've got here is actually the recipe for 4.7 litres of total misery. It was a very bad car, and it was ugly. Still, at least it made them try harder with the Enzo.